Hey guys, it's Julia and good morning. Um, I'm vlogging today apparently, so. Some days I just get weird inspiration to vlog, but it is currently 7 a.m. So I'm kind of talking quiet because I don't want to wake anyone up, but I've been up since 5 just hanging out with my dad and stuff. So I already had a coffee and today we're just gonna do some to-do list stuff, do some basic stuff, do some reading, write a book review, maybe do some editing. So I thought I'd bring you guys along with me today. This is gonna be a really like chill vlog, so like, eh. But I already checked my tarot and horoscope for the day, so I have those two down, and I want to quickly tidy my room, get dressed just so I'm not like this all day, because I'm more productive when I get dressed. Um, and yeah, let's go. So I'm all dressed out and ready and I'm probably just going to do some of the things that you saw on my to-do list. This is a new app I've been using, not sponsored, but like just recently started using it like yesterday. So we're playing with it. Um, it's just a productivity app and yeah, it's called Habitica. I'll put it on the screen if you care, but basically you can level up your little character when you like achieve things and like you can get like animals and it's like you can do challenges it, it's really cool so like if you're a productivity like nerd or like to-do list person check this app out it's so far kind of fun so we'll see but i have some things i want to do on there like i already did a bunch of my like daily stuff so like morning skincare coffee make my to-do list quick tidy get ready my bed tarot horoscope stuff like that so i already did like those main things and then i have some planning and stuff to do some updates um that are in my task list for today so yeah let's try to get that done just finished doing a lot of my calendar stuff that i had to do so for my online calendar and my physical planner i had to do a lot of planning and stuff like that so i got that done and now I just updated my Goodreads stuff. So yesterday I finished a manga and then a few days before I finished um, an Alan Hopkins book. So I just updated those in my notebook because I also in my plan, like in my calendar planner, I have um, just a list of books I read with the star ratings and stuff. So I had to add them to my Goodreads as well. So I had to add them to my Goodreads as well. So that's what I was doing. I just write many reviews. This one's kind of a longer review actually, this one. Which I wrote a few days ago, but I just updated this that I read that one yesterday. Um, so I'm five books behind, which has never happened to me. I'm usually at like 50 at this time in the year, but it's fine. It's fine. So these are the books like that I've read so far this year. So not much, not my best reading year at clearly, but for me personally, just because I usually read, I'm usually at like 50 by now, but no we'll catch up we got this doing well with my tbr so like i actually read i cannot do anything so i'm actually doing well with my tbr i've read never again people kill people she's sweet home and then i want to read with gratitude tarot and the princess and the fangirl it's not like official but i'm surprised i got three of them done like i'm shocked look at that look at that yeah Hey guys, so it's been about an hour now. I am so shaky. Um, an hour or two, maybe. Uh, basically, I went... What did I do? I did some journaling, some planning, a bunch of stuff off my to-do list. And then I also went outside to do some things that I had to help out with. So 
I haven't done like yard outside work, like physical yard outside work in a long time. So my arms are really sore. So if this camera is shaking, that is why, because <laughs> my arms are like cramping and stuff because, okay, it doesn't matter. But point is, is I was doing yard work and I'm shaking like crazy because I probably upset some muscle in my body because it was like, what are you doing? So right now I just got in, so I'm just sitting down relaxing and I'm watching just a YouTube video, a planning video right now. And then I want to do some more computer stuff. So I always like working on my laptop. Like it's just kind of how I am. I think anybody who's like does social media or anything like that, really likes working on their laptop. So like same. So I might import some footage. I don't know. Um, I want to start my book with gratitude. So hopefully we'll start that and yeah i've already gotten so much done today and it's only like 9 30 and i've been up since five no four five 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 but i went to bed at 1 a.m so i slept like four hours so like i am probably going to crash at some point today which will be interesting when that happens so yeah i also don't want to burn myself out like i could have worked outside for another hour or two but then i know tomorrow i would be like dead and i'm like the master at burning myself out by doing too much in one day without like proper buildup. So we're not gonna do that today. We're gonna try to be responsible about that. <laughs> so it is a bit later, it's like five o'clock. Um, I just, I don't know what I've been doing really. I took a bit of a rest just cause I got like, hmm, like four hours the night before. But today's, did I mention it's a holiday? So like, I don't have school. So like, it's kind of a rest day. I mapped out some things that I want to do this week just on this guy and then I've been using this app that I mentioned earlier oh well first off I changed my like Instagram icons don't they look so cute I love them um but like you can check stuff off and level up your character and it's all tasks and it's cool I've been doing just like a bunch of little tasks on there that I had to get done but I also what else do I need to do today um, I've mostly, like, I keep adding new stuff to my to-do list just because I finished all my to-dos at, like, 10, and then I'm like, what do I do now? Because, like, right now I don't have, like, homework homework, so I'm like, so I'm probably gonna start with gratitude tonight and try to finish that for tomorrow. I could finish it in a day, but it's like, maybe I'll try to finish it tomorrow. And then I also have an audiobook. I have The Princess and the Fangirl by Ashley Poston. So like I want to listen to that. So I might start that audiobook or start it tomorrow. But those are my plans. Um, I was going to make this like a daily thing. But like I might combine this as like a weekly vlog. And also like have some like my school and productivity stuff in here. And yeah. So we hope that, that works. <laughs> Happy Tuesday. So today I have school. I'm actually just leaving in like like two minutes so we're ready for school kind of so i just want to give you guys a reading update last night i ended up starting and finishing with gratitude i quite liked it i think it has like a lot of meaningful poems and they're not really as opposed to just like prose and like just advice and kind of that poetry format which i just really liked i think it's a good reminder um, I don't think you have to read it in one sitting. I think you can read little bits of it or anything like that. If you just need to like appreciate some things more or be reminded of certain things in your life, I think this is really good. Um, so I'm giving it about like a 3.75 or so just because I think like it achieved the purpose it was supposed to and like I did not enjoy my time reading it. Um, I would definitely read like books similar to this just because I thought this was a good reminder to keeping things more positive. So yeah that's my update on that i might start an audiobook today we'll see we got school so let's go to school yay anyways hey guys so it is later on it is about nine o'clock now my hair is like this because i took a bath don't mind that i'm also red because the bath was hot um i just want to update you guys so i read a bit of the princess and the fangirl I listened to a little bit of audiobook, not enough to say. I don't know if I said that already. I don't know. Anyways, I did some work and then my boyfriend dropped by for a while. So he left about an hour or two ago. And I've just been 
relaxing. I took a bath. That's about it. Guys, so it is Wednesday. Um, I'm always filming in the same spot. I'm sorry, but I'm usually sitting at my desk when I decide to update my vlog. But right now we're exporting video that I finished editing, um, which is this one. It'll be up by the time this vlog goes up. It's basically just my thoughts on the new Ted Bundy and Netflix film with Zac Efron and Lily Collins. So that will be up. Um, I'm excited but really nervous about it. Um, I don't know, like I know the videos that are gonna get hate and like this is one of them. <laughs> so I'm kind of just like prepping for it. Like there's always a bit of hate on every video but this one I feel like is just gonna like, it might not get a good response. So, but I'm still, like I back up everything I said. So like I'm gonna post it but I just feel like a lot of people are gonna hate it. But like, whatever. Um, so yeah, interested to see the thoughts on that. But last night I started tarot and like I quite, like I only read like 20 pages, but I think it's really interesting the way it's shaped out. It just feels very magical in a way that I really like. And the tarot cards are like actual people, some of them. So they're really cool. Like it's not like the card, it's like a person, but like, I don't know like I'll explain more about it later but like it's just really interesting the way it's set up I'm really excited to see like what it's even about like so far this girl's been in captivity by her father who's like not her father some drama only 20 pages in so like I don't know but yeah she's been like she weaves together these like basically these tarot cards like they look like tarot cards and that's like you know all the tarot cards like the lover the I don't even think the lover was one of them, but like, exit like that's an example of a tarot card, and so it's like those. And then she did one of the moon, and her dad is like, "Why did you draw the moon?" Like he's mad. So it's like, why? We don't know. So we're gonna figure it out. And she's trapped there, so she'll probably escape at some point. We'll see. I don't know why I'm doing this. Oh, my cat. Pretty, pretty.